to my kitchen today I will be roasting a whole chicken so the first thing I'm going to do is make a rub I'm going to take two teaspoons of paprika whoops one teaspoon of salt One teaspoon of onion powder. One teaspoon of thyme. One teaspoon of garlic powder. And a half a teaspoon of black pepper. And just mix those all together. Okay, once you have your spices mixed up, I've washed and dried my chicken. It's a little over five pounds. So I am going to just rub it with some olive oil. And you wanna rub all parts of the chicken. and get it coated with the olive oil okay once you have your chicken all rubbed with oil i am just going to stuff it okay i have it all stuffed i will link that video for my homemade stuffing and then I'm going to take my seasoning and I am just going to rub it all over my chicken and you want to rub it in really really good and get all parts of the chicken And then I am going to put it in a 325 degree oven for about an hour and a half and then I'm going to check the temperature to make sure that it is at least 165 degrees Fahrenheit. I am not going to baste this while it's cooking. mainly because every time you open the oven you lose heat so I am just going to let it cook and I'll be back and show you what it looks like okay so it's been about 50 minutes and I'm just going to add some potatoes to my roasting pan so I have about 20 small potatoes I'm just going to Put about a tablespoon of olive oil and a teaspoon of thyme, a teaspoon of garlic powder, and a teaspoon of basil, and salt and pepper to taste, probably about a half a teaspoon and mix that all together and I just pulled my chicken out to put the potatoes in I'm just going to lay them around my chicken and I'm going to put them back in the oven for another 35 to 40 minutes until my chicken reaches 165 degrees So it's been about an hour and a half and our chicken is done. Just going to take it out 
and put it on a serving tray. And I'm going to take the stuffing out and then I'm going to cover it with tin foil and let it sit for about 10 minutes before I cut it. Okay, so I have my stuffing all out and my potatoes on my serving tray and my chicken's been resting for about 10 minutes. And I'm just going to cut into this so you can see how juicy it is. This is super easy to make and it smells amazing. I hope you enjoyed. Thanks so much for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. That would help me out a great deal. And I will see you on the next one.